What's up everybody, Grievous back with another Yu-Gi-Oh! Master Duel video. Today's gate is the Warriors of Yore. That's the second gate coming with the Six Samurai series. I'm really excited to do this gate, I love the Six Samurai cards. Make sure you guys stay all the way to the end because we are busting open packs at the end of each and every gate. Also, make sure you guys are following me on TikTok. There, you can find exclusive content that you won't find anywhere else. Now with all that out of the way, let's get on to the video. The Warriors of Yore. This is the story about when Great Shogun Sheen was a young man and became known as the Warlord who virtually dominated the land. In the time of warring states, there were those who ran across the battlefield like shooting stars. They claimed victory after victory, and their country expanded its territories at breakneck pace. The Shogun ruled the country and led its armies with great skill. Especially outstanding were the six warriors under his command. People called them the Six Samurai. Rumors of these mighty warriors and the Shogun they served spread among the neighboring countries. He stood in battle alongside the Six Samurai and never faced defeat, yet he carried a small seat of worry. One day, he fell ill to a disease that infested his body. Still, the Shogun hid it from all but a few close associates and ruled the country vigorously and without rest. He continued to fight fiercely as if shaking off the disease. I don't know when the Lord is resting. No one has ever seen the Shogun sleeping. As these jokes were uttered by the soldiers and people, one day the last straw broke on the camel's back. Just when he was preparing for a big battle, the Shogun fell ill and died an unexpected death. I cannot let the other countries know of my father's death now. One of the six samurai and son of the Shogun was Shi In. Shi In kept his father's death under wraps and led his army into battle in his place. The target was a mountainous country located to the east of the Castle of the Mist. It was the castle that served as the enemy base. Terrain analysis, troop size, and strategy, all of the above were calculated and victory seemed assured. However, the enemy had seen right through Shi In and his advances. Enemy troops and the trees on the mountainside all attacked Shi In and the Six Samurai. The Six Samurai struggled to hold their own, but they faced an unexpectedly desperate battle. As the enemy soldiers attacked with increasing vigor, Shi In finally ordered his troops to retreat. However, in that moment, there was a great disturbance in the line of command. After all, these were the soldiers who had never lost a battle. The majority of them had no experience in retreating. Moreover, the confusion caused by the surprise attack and receiving orders from a different commander made matters worse. Morale was lowered as one by one the soldiers were taken out. If this continues, they could be rooted. That was when one of the six samurai, Shinai, who was alongside Shein, suddenly turned around. He then offered these words to Shein. Our unit will serve as the rear guard. The main unit must survive and return to the country at any cost. He was the strongest man among the six samurai, reserved, but also the warrior Shien's late father trusted the most. Shien saw the determination in Shinai's eyes and once again he ordered the entire army to retreat. As Shinai watched Shien, he seemed to smile silently with approval. That was how the six samurai and Shien barely escaped to their country. But even as Shien's wounds from the war began to heal, not a single man from Shinai's unit ever returned. He had lost his father, who was the Shogun, and a soldier of the Six Samurai. For Shien and the remaining Six Samurai, this battle was a bitter defeat that they would never forget. The loss of Shien's father, who was the Shogun, soon became known both nationally and internationally and distressed the citizens of the nation. For the other countries competing to claim supremacy, this was an opportunity they could not have wished for. A warlord from another country might invade at any time. How do they settle this mess? How should they fight in the future? Xi'an was deep in thought. And then, his father's confidant and the one appointed as his guardian, Xi'an's advisor, told him without hesitation, Now is the time for you to stand as the next Shogun. You must prove to the world that you will be the one to rule over all the land. 
And let us not only win battles, let us raise a country that matches the heavenly world. To achieve this, it is essential to build a solid foundation. When you achieve this, you can call yourself a true master of the world. Sheehan's determination was renewed by these words. Using defeat as a springboard, he devised an array of strategies. The country's military and its national influence was enhanced, and they proceeded to invade countries to expand their territory. They devised a system to make it harder to be invaded, and quickly the country stabilized itself. Meanwhile, Sheehan was also racking up victories in battle. When his smoke signal rose over the battlefield, the soldiers of other countries would tremble in fear. After some time, Xi'an of the Six Samurai inherited his father's position and began calling himself Great Shogun Sheen. And alongside him stood the newly appointed Six Samurai. They have sworn their absolute loyalty and fight as the backbone of the army. The samurai that fought together on the battlefield before he became Shogun continued to be active in a variety of ways. Kageki was feared as a four-armed demon god with the secondary arms he could manipulate at will. He was long active on the battlefield but retired from the Six Samurai due to his injuries and went on to serve on the home front. Kaizen was a glorious swordsman that won many battles and was feared by the enemy due to rumors that he was able to cut through the soul. Upon his victory in the Imperial Match, he was entrusted with the recruitment and cultivation of new candidates for the next generation of Six Samurai. 
As Grandmaster of the Six Samurai, his skill with the sword showed no signs of wavering, even late into his years. The achievements of the newly forged Six Samurai trained by said commander spoke for themselves. And Nishi was said to have fearlessly charged into the enemy forces and fought like a rampaging wild boar. When Shin's advisor retired and Nishi coordinated internal affairs and took over the role of advising Shin, he was appointed to the position of Chancellor, and even after leaving the battlefield, his fight continues. In warfare and sometimes as a secret agent, Mizuho took on the task of taking revenge through covert operations. She was bound to Shinai as husband and wife. After his death, she decided to pursue the life of monkhood. But when dealing with those posing a threat to Sheen, she still conducts her assignments the same way she always did. Along with the six samurai who once strove across the battlefield with Sheen, stood the new six samurai along with the next generation of vassals. Supporting these vassals, Great Shogun Sheen continues to fight for supremacy and unification of the country. What's up everybody, Griff is here back in the store with the Great Shogun's Rule. That's the secret pack we got for busting out the warriors of yore. The ultra rares we're looking for are the legendary Six Samurai Shein. We're also looking for the supers, the Six Samurai United. Looking for that ultra battle Shogun of the Six Samurai, the Gateway of the Six, and the Shadow of the Six Samurai Shein. Any of those cards would be really awesome to have, so let's go ahead Bust open our first of two packs, and let's see if we can pull any of these awesome cards. Alright, first pack looking good. Looking more than good. What's up, my dude? How you doing? Cutting it open, that rainbow glow. Kaiba. Flipping them over. And uh, that's what I'm talking about, boy. That's what I'm talking about. Checking out the cards. We got the Marinsis Blue Slug. World Legacy Struggle. DD Necro Slime. Element Saber Mallow, the Six Samurai Yavriza, the Legendary Six Samurai Kageki, Legendary Six Samurai She In, our Ultra Rare. That's sick. That's awesome. Awesome to pull. And then we got Inchi, Sheen's Chancellor. Let's go ahead, pull our second pack, and let's see if we can pull any other awesome cards. All right, pack number two. This one looks normal, that's fine. We got that huge pull in the first pack. I'll take any cards in this, I really love this series. Flipping them over, checking out the cards. We got the number 77, the seven sins. Ancient Gear Trill, Miracle Fusion, Dragon's Fighting Spirit, The Six Samurai Come On, Six Samurai Hatsume, Six Samurai Ginpa, Asceticism of the Six Samurai. Alright y'all, and that's going to do it for today's video. If you enjoyed it, make sure you hit that like button and consider subscribing. It's the best way to help support the channel. And until next time guys, this has been Griefus saying, later.